Yo, no, it's not a red one. Okay, so problem that we've been having, you guys have said that there's lag every time I watch stuff, right? Yeah. Yeah, we, we'll have the clap join. So it's just a delay. No, it's not Twitch in general. There's a legit delay. Is it me talking? Whenever it's on speakers. Okay. So like Can you play say a song that you want me to play for you? Here? Sit, sit. You couldn't even play that one. Okay, well that one it's weird. Anything else? What do you My pick one? way. Yeah, you could just type in a So it's only when I go back and forth in speakers? That's interesting. We never had that problem. Ari also had it. Yeah, but there's that's not a house thing. That's just a Um Very famous song. No. Um. Hmm. What the fuck is this? Uh, so it's only on speakers, so I guess I just don't play it on my speakers anymore. <clears> hmm. <throat> Try to fix it. I don't know. I don't know what the possible issue is, though. The only thing I could possibly think of is Victor didn't put it in the wrong spot. He didn't. There's something that's with it. That's the only thing I can think of. Um, but I'm not an audio guy. So I don't know. Oh, fuck. We're lucky. going to get all the stuff for my birthday party. And we're only going to one place. We need chips. And more chips. Boxes of trail mix. Soft and chewy granola bars. Fuck yeah. Plates for the cake. These kids get thirsty. We need some juice boxes. Like I said, these kids get thirsty. I think that's everything we need. Do you trail think mix. it's over or under $150? And of course I couldn't leave without my chicken bake. And my double chunk chocolate cookie. Fuck yeah. All right, last chance. Are we over $150? We're under $150. Classic chips mix. One flavor mix. 36 pack apple and Eve. Another Bro, one. It's gotta be under. Another 36 pack apple and Eve. Soft and chewy granola bars. Trail mix. <laughs> Plates for the cake. And the water. And the total is $143. Fuck yeah. One cent. Costco gets a big boom. Sometimes there's a weird ro robot double audio with the headphones too. Uh, ask his dad's DRT TRT clinic. Yeah, his def his dad's definitely on the big boom. For sure, for sure. Um. Hmm. 
Hmm. I mean, if there's no delay here, Child I guess I can just use speed. I was just trying to make this plan for tomorrow. I didn't even there's want no delay to. still here, right? My body was just so tired. It was day two. <laughs> I'll just splash water in my face. Everything hurts. Like, this is insane. And then one of the refs just comes up to me. He's like, hey. Hmm, okay. I guess it's just the audio. Um, I guess I'll just leave the audio on. Alinny's coming over tomorrow to do the tree. So, I guess... Um... It's gonna get the big booms. Watch your collabs. Yeah, I haven't really <coughs> seen anything. Um, I got sick at Cutie's party. Well, not sick, but I've just been coughing. Uh, if he looks exactly like mine, it's dog shit. And clats. Uh, only thanks. No idea when it starts. It really did piss me off when people were like, you can't do OnlyFangs without Emeru. It's like, bro, you're trolling me. She, it was a fun time last year. I, I, honestly, like, the second go-around of that same shtick would get old. I just don't see it. Like, it, it's just going to be way too... It, it's going to be the same shit. She's going to die to random things. I'm going to have to carry her. Asma's going to react, and that would be it. It's just, I really was surprised when people were saying that because it's one thing if like it was the same people from last time but it's so many more people it, it's not even comparable you have tyler one tim the tap man summit one g uh shroud i mean the truth is like how did emmy level she leveled because she got carried and she got carried to 60. I mean, she died five times and got five Staff of Jordans. There was, there was no... It was all handouts. People only watch for you too. Sure. That's fine. If they don't want to watch this time around because Emmy's not there, that's okay. I can't care. I will still play the WoW meta throughout the whole thing and keep doing what I'm doing. I cannot care. But I know Chance is a ton planned, so it should be really good. I'm not worried about it. He has a lot planned. Uh -oh. um. If she wants to play with you, who Emmy, that's fine. I'll play. But I just know that she doesn't want to play. Uh much so i don't think she wants to commit the amount of hours she did it was a lot i mean you have to realize we would go on my stream for 12 hours and her stream for 12 hours we did that every day for two months uh, it was a lot like mentally it was a lot uh Yeah, T1's joining. Plans for OnlyFans? Nah, not much. I want to do the camping stream, but depending on when WoW gets announced, I mean, it might be hard. I'm hoping it gets announced for like bit November 26th or something so I can go do the camping stream. Uh, who are you thinking of leveling with? Just everybody. Like playing with everybody, doing stuff with everyone. Mm-hmm. 
Damn, yeah, no skits out to ask me stupid questions. Surprise. All right, this works, I guess. Tomorrow we'll do the tree. React to clips. I heard Nora's coming here in a week, which is really exciting. Crazy. Um, Kachi was apparently having some drama and problems. So it should be really good this week. And then the wild meta. What's up with you, Arthur? Seen Arthur? Yeah. What a random question. I've been seeing your clicks. I'm very self I'm sorry. But there's no way you waited like four hours to ask me this. <laughs> I didn't know how to bring that. Does that mean I'm just gonna very social a little bit, you know? I just wanna know. So why did you? Why'd you wait more hours to ask me this? I'm sorry. <laughs> Dude, how brain rotted am I now that a minute and 47 long clip is just too long for me to watch? I'm shy. Uh, how do I answer this? Your question is, what's up with me and Arthur? Yeah, like, why is there anything like... Like, I'm like scared about what's happened to my brain. I see you guys like... Talking and just farming. Um, we're just really, we're pretty good. We're really good friends. Like we get along really well, and we know like I feel like naturally know what each other's intentions are. We get along really well. I, yeah, I think <laughs> everybody here. <laughs> He's, uh, he's taken. Will he be doing other content as well? Probably. I mean, probably. I mean, I'm sure, bro. I, I didn't just do. I, I did well out of World of Warcraft. I don't know. I mean, I, I want to do more what I want, man. I, I mean, I've been doing this for seven years, and I really do want to just do what I want when I want because there's no reason at this point not to. I have all the money in the world. I have everything I need. I've done everything I wanted. I have things I want. Well, that's not true. I have things I want to do, but I just feel like living that life of just like constantly needing the feed is just such a stupid idea. And I haven't really done it in like a year. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know. Yeah, he's taken by, by another guy. He's not gay. Oh, he's taken by another man. How did that so. work? I don't know. He's just very, very much invested in another man's life. There's no space for me in his mind. Oh, you know? So that, we don't want that. Yeah. Yeah. We don't want that. Yeah, exactly. Like maybe if maybe if he had more space in his life. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh no, people are saying it's getting stale. I can't believe the only one tired of everyone clip farming. Yes, the streamers are pretty unauthentic to how the cameras are. We know act 90% of the time, but that's an extra degree of in inauthenticity on top of the usual act. No. No. I don't want it to end. It's 90% of my clip queue. Don't end. Well, there is going to be a civil war in Nick's community. It's going to be. Uh, what's her name? Nora versus Kachi. Who's best for Nick? I'm excited. When are you going to start doing shameless shipping content? Mm, probably never. Um, 
because I don't know if I can ever do that again because I did it with Maya for so long. I just don't know. I feel like I did that. It's like something I did. Like I really did it. You know, I really farmed. It's hard for me to want to go back to something like that because it really did. It's like, I don't want to ever compare people doing that. Did you enjoy it all? Uh, I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah, you know I loved it. What the fuck? I love that shit. But at the same time, it, it also, like, you do it once. If you do it again, it's like, I don't know. That makes sense, right? Don't get me wrong, I'm sure I'll still do girl content. I mean, obviously I still will, of course I will. But I don't see myself, like, doing straight up, you know, content like that. I just don't see myself doing it. Well, maybe. If I meet the right person to farm with. But I feel like for me, the word farm is so weird now. Farm. It's like... But I really want to not be at least fucking them. Smell me. Why is this a clip? This just in. Emru explaining why she spent two hundred dollars on ant traps. Acting like you don't farm shippers with extra Emily. I would like you to find me an extra Emily farming, please. Would you go ahead and show me the clips where people are farming me an extra Emily? I would love to see it. Go ahead. I don't have shippers. Well, I do, but not for extra Emily. And if I do, they're so small, who gives a fuck? No one, there's no channels, videos, anything here. Yeah, that's really farming shippers, dude. Is that we're pregnant? A joke? Because you've been probably watching me since Ice Poseidon era that I would make. You really think this... Check that guy's logs in your main chat. This is like the least shippy thing I probably ever posted. I didn't even think of it like that. This is the best you have, Pooner. This is what you think me and Xtremly is farming, is this picture. This is all you got. You've been watching me probably nonstop for six years straight. This is all you have is a picture of me and Emily with I said I'm pregnant. Did I say that she's pregnant? No. Black. I'm back. Oh. Yeah, I'm on my ult. I was just trying to fix my audio. Hi, sweetie. Uh, when did you get back? Do you know? Uh, like an hour ago. No. <clears throat> pretty good. Right now? Yeah. yeah. Wait, she's streaming your room? Yeah. She's psychotic. <laughs> hmm. Well, she only took like an hour. She wanted to get in. Because she's going back in, so she wanted to get in. Snack. Can 
pixel the maids. <laughs> I mean, the house isn't dirty. So I don't think we even need the maids this week. The class and bunny can kill each other. Class with the dirt can kill y'all. <sighs> Andreas' Instagram post is kind of towing that line for sure, but it's I said Discord mods, and also I didn't even know she was making that, so that's not on me. That's not me. Why don't you come and lack? Mm. Were people taking that post the wrong way? No, bro. Me and me and Andre are literally just brother and sister retards. Um. No, I'm of course I'm proud of Arab. He's a boy. He actually deserves it. I say him or T10 Nat deserved it for sure. I didn't really care who won, but I did want one of them to win. But I think Arav has clearly shown that he's a, a clickle quackle. What's so bad about doing shipping content? Nothing. There, there's nothing bad. Um, I think the problem is it's an exhausting audience is really the the downsides of it. Uh, because they get very, like, you know how I just take off for, like, multiple days and, like, people don't really care? That's because people don't really care, you know? Like, they don't, they're not fully following my life to an, a massive extent. So, therefore, my life is not something I have to just constantly be in stress that I have to be doing stuff. When... Like, people become reliant on you because they're parasocial so hard that they rely on you and your life. And that if you even take a day off, they get mad. And the over-psychoanalyzing of every person around you is something that happens no matter what. But when you're farming shippers, it gets really ugly. And it also gets really annoying. Like, the viewers can be very cringe. They're not fun. Or funny. It's it, it's like it's funny for like the first like month and then it gets really old. Um so that's that's partially it. But is there anything wrong with it? I mean I guess people can make the argument that like lying to your audience is not a good thing. Right? Like, you're you're basically lying to them to farm views if you're not really liking them. But it's also, like, you can just see it as a show. But people are going to get mad if it's lies. You know what I mean? I don't know how you streamers deal with all those people and those opinions. I would, I mean, just get used to it. Um, but I mean, I just don't have it anymore. I don't really farm that. Besides, I'm farming Nyx because I love it. Uh, Hachi viewers hated all the other OTK top streamers. I mean, is that really true? Hey, 5,000 people from Nick's community hated everybody else. I don't believe that. Not, yeah, Nick's got a good few months for sure. I mean, Nora coming. Um everything else, it should be fucking sweet. I've been watching for like five years, but I lost the plot. What do you have planned next without leaking? Uh, well, I mean, I do want to 
after WoW, really reconsider living in Austin. Um, because I just feel like there's got to be more to life than living in the middle of nowhere or living in Austin when, honestly, like, you guys can understand something. Like, yes, I do have a lot of friends here, but I have a lot of friends everywhere. And it's hard. Like, I, I just, I also do like L.A. I like the L.A. people. I have a lot of trauma in Austin still. I'm still not over what happened two years ago. I still have trauma every day. So, and I know the more I get away from Austin, the better I feel. I've also been watching 2018. I feel like Austin's a done chapter. Yeah, I, I kind of agree. I mean, think about like this week. Like I was on, and I didn't even try to do collabs. Like literally did not try to do anything. I, I, was, I thought I was going to LA just to hang out. I didn't, I didn't think I was going to do any collabs. The only collab I knew was Foosley. But I was on Ray stream. I was on Hassan stream. I was on Agent stream. I did that short with fucking whatever her name is. Uh, Andrea. Uh, that OTB video was huge. Like that was huge for Miskiff Enterprises. That got a million views. You know. Would it always be like that if you live there though? I don't want to rely on streamers though. I I I'd rather collab with people that are not just streamers. And there's so many people that want to. The truth is just no one there does. Does helping mid slash small creators benefit you? Yeah, it makes my brand look good. That's the real reason you didn't go to Emory's party? Um, no. The real reason why I didn't go to Emory's party is, one, I knew that I was going to be sinking my life into World of Warcraft probably after, in a week from now, for the next two and a half months, and I would not be leaving Austin. Two, uh, the progressive show was happening, and I knew that this whole week was just going to be all about the progressive show, and I did, really did not want to be here because I just knew that no one was going to hang out besides doing that show, and I can't be on it, so it's pretty bad. Um, and uh, that was really it. Those are the big two reasons. So like, all right, like, I have some friends out there that want to hang out and go to a party or two. I might as well do that. Then, uh, peace out. All right. So they have a meeting last week and planned a lot. It sounds like you were not doing any of it. I don't think that's true. You, I think the shows for OTK are just kind of done. I mean, Nick might be planning stuff with the two Asian women, but that's about it. I don't think you hear Nick planning stuff with Asmin or really Soda or anyone else at OTK. It's really just two Asian girls that farm. Besides game day, which obviously I'll be there. I'll be there. There was a meeting, OT community with S-Fan, and they planned a lot. I mean, that's nice. I just, I'm telling you that... They can plan a lot. That's fine. I just don't. We'll see when things actually happen. I mean, it's probably going to be a lot of things that are just like, this is a good stream for the day. It's not like events. I don't really know what events we're going to be doing. We didn't really do anything this year besides the show. That's it. <laughs> Uh, 
Um, Nick, I don't know if Nick will be nominated. I, you know what I think I realized in a problem? Well, I know what the problem is. None of our community voted besides Nick's. Literally none. I'm pretty sure Emmys didn't. I forgot. Uh, I don't think Extra Emily did. I just don't think we care. Voting for Ludwig and Ray. We just don't have those kind of communities. I, I mean, I feel like Nick kind of does right now because he definitely got a younger audience, but I don't think they even will give him that. He can win, like, best IRL streamer, maybe. But I feel like if they're going to really give it to someone, it'd be speed. I think Speed and Kai are just going to win a lot of awards. It did have a boomer audience, but for sure, when you when you farm parasocials, there's there's people that are farming paras or parasocial viewers exist when they're older, but not like it's it's really a thing in your earlier twenties. I, I I don't think it's more of a thirty year old thing. But yeah, Nick's audience definitely got way younger. He did have a boomer audience for sure um, with Milena, but not anymore. Uh, I do think Nick probably would deserve best, maybe best just chatting streamer. Then I'd say IRL, probably be Speed. Best streamer award, I'd probably give that to Speed too, to be honest. And then, I don't even know the other awards. I think Sapphire will be Senna. I think that's... That, that community, like the FaZe community, the W community, like they're all voting. Because they, they care. They feel like it matters. Like, they want their people deserve to win. Like, the problem with our community is, like, they just don't care. And I don't blame you guys for not caring. But you don't. You don't care. Now, nah, Arav Waker T10 that's not winning that. I feel like you guys don't care either. I mean, we really don't. I, I, it's my energy can be pushed somewhere else than that. Uh. Yeah, I think Jason's probably going to win something. Probably maybe top just chatting streamer. I think Kai's going to win best streamer. Speed's going to win best IRL streamer. Senna's going to win a Sapphire Award easily. Uh, and then... I don't really care. I don't know the other awards. That fires for like women.
orange. No, I don't want to move away from Twitch or streaming. Not at all. Uh, nope. I I just don't. I. The the thing is that I know and understand is people. We've been doing this now for seven years, and as much as like the parasocial farming or whatever we do or the content we do works now. It's more so something that, like, I would want to slowly ease away from as I get older, as I do this longer, because it's not a long-term solution. You know what I mean? So, uh, the question is what? Because it's hard, right? Like, you can't be in your... 10th year streaming and farming the same kind of stuff. It gets old. Uh, but I also want to really start learning on stream. Like, I, I I do envy people like Hassan and Asmin who learn things on stream. Uh, when a lot of my stuff is learning about, like, Nick and what, who he, what girl he's talking to that day, you know? It's like, there's not a lot of learning that goes on. Cultivated the idiot persona too much? Sure. That's true. Um, maybe. But, I mean, it is something that I would either, A, have to work, a work, a work, a work away from. Um... That's, like, over time. No, I don't want to be a song. Maybe the MMA connection and become the Joe Rogan of Twitch. It's such a long-term thing. That's, like, really long. Um... Yeah, real estate's something I would do. YouTube's actually full of Nick. I mean, dude, it, you guys have known the trend of what's happened to the internet. Like, everywhere. It's just clips. That's all the internet is now. Dude, f who gives a fuck about long-form content? It's just clips. It's insane. It's all clips. It's all I see everywhere. Everyone is always seeing just clips everywhere. It's all about clips. It's in it, what What happened? Everything is clips. TikTok did rot the internet. I was talking to um, your pregnant tweet gave him so much content. I like hanging out with Andrea a lot. She she likes to just do anything, um, including that. But um, I was talking to who was I talking to? Um, Eric about it. And he was like, yeah, basically every YouTuber knows that 
the only thing that they care about now is, sh- is short form content. Um, long form content pays the bills. Short form content gets the views. Like it's stupid. Asmund's an anomaly. Need to adapt. I mean, yeah, it's just farming shipping co- or fuck farming clipping, and and that's it. It's just farming clips. That's all that matters now is just how many clips per month views you get. Um, Jillian recommended me. She's like, you should do this thing. She basically set up a Discord for me. She's like, um, where she pays her. So Philian pays her, her viewers to create clips of her and make accounts, and then they get paid for it. She's like, I pay them like $20,000 a month. I'm like, holy fuck, that's a lot of money. Um, you tried that a bunch? No. Oh, I did try it for a month, and it fucking destroyed. I didn't try it 10 times. Pooner is so cool. I tried it once for January and it literally was insane. It worked too well. Cutie does that too? Oh, I didn't know Cutie does that. Yeah, well, Philian was telling me that apparently everyone does it. Like, all the W and Phase kids do it. And so does... Most content creators. Uh, why'd you stop? It, it was honestly, in, it, the, the truth is, I, I did it in January of 2023. It was right after I got canceled. Uh, and I didn't have the money. I, I, it went, it, I did too well. I, I had to pay like, I think it was like $18,000 that month. And I was just like, holy fuck. Like, I don't even know if next month's guaranteed. And it blew up. Why not restart it now? No, that's that's a thing. She's like, do you want to use my server? I said, yeah. So I might announce it on stream tomorrow that I'm using the server. Um, Because she said that it quadrupled her amount of clips. Philian gets like 100 million impressions a month on, on short form content. Yeah. It's insane. But 50, uh, 75 million was from that server last month. I get her clips and shorts all the time. Yeah, she. it's all from this server. So she's like, why don't you just be my guinea pig and you try it? And I'm like, okay. Because <coughs> now <coughs> I'm in a better spot financially. <coughs> or I just don't. I mean, yeah, I can do it now. Pooner, why are you here watching if you hate me so much? You're subscribed for three months. Why do you watch if you hate so much? What is going on in your life? Like it's just low effort reward? No, I, I disagree. I think it, it it's what works. I mean, you guys get paid. And essentially what it would do is put my content to other spheres so people can... Would have never have seen my content in the first place. Can see it. She's the main content on her channel. You're not. Your short form content doesn't help your growth. It absolutely does. That's just not true. It it completely does. My obviously my short form content is gonna be me collabing with people. That just means I need to collab with people, which I do anyway. 
It's funny to see ramble and say the same things over and over just to do something different in a week. Thank you, Pooner. How does it feel that you're watching me do that while I make hundreds of thousands of dollars a month rambling? And enjoying my life, getting to do whatever I want. Going to do whatever I get to do. And you just sit here and complain. Well, I just get on stream whenever I want and get to talk to hundreds of people about rambling about the same stuff. How does that make you feel? If you keep saying you're happy, maybe one day you'll believe it. Mm, I know I'm happy. You want me to say I'm not happy? Does that make any logic? I feel like lowball jokes land more for clips, like Philly and falling over. Oh, no, you're absolutely right. So one thing that I told... uh feeling about I was like well you realize something is my clips do farm I, I do farm my clips all the time it does work um but I told her that I don't want clips that are not good context enough for someone to understand because one problem I do have for my stream is my stream is not and really no streamer that we're friends with the problem with like the Austin community and friend group in general is all of our streams are so reliant on like 15 other different characters it's hard to really just like watch them and like fall in love with them, right? Like if you're watching Nick, it's like you have to know like 20 different people. So it's tough to uh, like fall in love with the stories. You know what I mean? And inside jokes, all that thing, all those stuff. Um, when someone like Fillion, who's like, yeah, like her contents, you laugh, you lose, and then falling over. And then it makes a fart sound. Feels like you used to farm clips a lot easier in 2019. Well, back then, mm, not really. Those were that was that was when I was the most inside jokey ever. No, I'm not bringing back you left loose. Fuck that. Cloudic was funny. Normie humor is the future. No, but I mean. There are clips like you don't need to have full context to get views on clips anymore. Like I can streamers and people are known pretty well. You don't need it. I mean, Senna and agent, you don't, you, you obviously they're like way, way, way bigger in that context, but like there is communities that know all of us pretty well. I'm not really too worried about it, but it'd be something like, can anyone, I, well, I told her, uh, Philly knows. I was like, they can't use something like garden clat. You know what I mean? Like no one's going to understand what the fuck that is. But if it's, if it's me reacting to like Nick or agent or somebody or like Cinna, like, yeah, people do know them. Um, Emmy's clips always do well, good view wise. And it's just her doing something so simple. I don't think I can do that. I'm pretty sure I can't do that. I could try. I mean, farming clips is easy. I mean, did you see what I just did with fucking, what's her name? Andrea? It's a joke. She literally just told me to sit there and smack my head on, on the, because I was playing with that around the house.
and what is it at now? It's at half a million views in 12 hours. Oh, she's sponsored by Coach? She's a hot girl. Easy. I mean, she is popular on other websites. Shipper clips get... No, here's the problem with shippers. The problem with shippers is over time, they get obsessed with specific characters, and they fall in love with them. And then if you try to, to move away from that, they get angry and mad. And they legitimately start fighting. That's why shippers suck. suck. It's because they, they're going to get sick of all of this. And that's how it always goes. They get angry. They complain because they're going to be like, well, Nick should be with Kachi. Well, Nick should be with her. Happens every time. Fights will begin. Civil wars will happen. They get so invested, they're going to get mad. But we will be there reacting to it. Nick's been cracking down on it. I mean, Nick hasn't started it. When, when Nora comes, that's when the big boom's coming. The five booms of death. It will be good content, though. He will be watching the fuck out of it. Which is why you need a shipping haram like Nick. Mmm... I mean, I'm pretty happy with my streams. I'm not really too... I'm not... I'm pretty happy with how things are going. We've had... I mean, I've had great streams. I've had... I'm totally okay with how things are going. I know my arms look jacked. Which con? What the fuck? Where is he, Russell? Oh, this? Classic. Um, all right, let's see if this lags. If it doesn't, we're going to bed. So it was you the ants followed you from one house to another? No! Is that lagging? I, mean, I guess it works. Yes, you are boring place, my. Oh yeah, no, people really believe in the Nick Sharp farming. They they're they're fully invested. Cause they don't they just if you only watch clips, you would think that they you would believe in the story. Of course they're gonna believe it.
No, they were asking about it nonstop. They're like, who's he dating? What's going on? I mean, it's interesting. It's like, wh what is fucking happening? <laughs> the 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 clip slip site does lag. It only lags when you pause a clip. Means you are boring, place like. Nick many times showed that he doesn't want Kachi. People just don't see the clues. I know. We're going to investigate more of it tomorrow for sure. I do agree with you. The body language is, was definitely off. Also, Kachi said some weird things on stream that made me upset. Ms. Emmy schizos are on another level. Uh, maybe that was true like two, three years ago. I don't think that the Emmy Ms. schizos are on another level anymore. I think all the schizos just jump shift Nick. I haven't heard or seen about them in so long. Yeah, I mean, Cine and Agents is like actual viral. Like, people ship them so hard. They, they get like 5 million view clips on TikTok. It's like insane. It's insane how big... AMP is compared to all of us. It's actually insane. Gay, 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 gay. Uh, all right, well, everything works. Is shipping the only thing you're going to talk about for the next two months? Uh, no, but you'll probably be talking about me for the next 12 hours in your discords. So go have fun with that, Pooner. Appreciate the insight. Try to be happy for once, Pooner. You seem like a very sad guy. Comp, you're so cute. 